I love to uh, hunt, period. That's the end of the story. I just love to hunt. And to be able to hunt as much as I, I do, you have to open your horizons. And by that, I mean, there's more seasons out there than just being a bow hunter, just being a gun hunter, just, you know, hunting with a shotgun, a muzzle, or whatever. So if you hunt with everything, you can hunt for a long period of time. I mean, my deer season generally starts in Kentucky on the 1st of September and ends in Texas on the last day of February, based on all these seasons and the means and methods that I can hunt with. So grabbing an air gun, just made a lot of sense because it was something else that I could hunt with and Texas is one of the states that allows you to hunt with an air gun. The ease of operation of the Air Saber and really any of the Umer X line of, of air guns that we've seen is, is it's really pretty impressive. You know, they've spent a lot of time obviously designing these to be able to maximize your time in the field. The trigger on the Air Saber was, I mean, it's sweet, about three and a half pounds or so, roughly in there of pressure. The safety's built right into the into the trigger, so it's easy to find. It's very quiet to move that around. You actually have two barrels to be able to shoot with, and it, there's just a, you know, you push a button to choose which barrel you're gonna shoot with, much like a shotgun. You know, you're shooting over and under or side by side, you choose which barrel, for the most part, goes off first. And uh, then and you cock it, and it's super fast and easy to be able to cock this thing for a follow-up shot. And, you know, we were shooting at anywhere from 20 to 50 yards with, with pretty good accuracy out there that we had confidence in what we were going to be able to do. But you still got to get it out in the field and run it through its paces. I picked up that air saber in the summer and was practicing with it, trying to learn more about it as we got into a different window. And as we got into January, when this hunt was actually filmed, conditions-wise, eh, well, not exactly the best, but you go when you, gotta, when you can go. We had a full moon and it was about 84 degrees. But I knew an area or two that had a lot of bucks who'd been moving in them. Plus, it's dry. It's post-rut down here. The deer are hungry. They're back on the food sources. So it's just a matter of getting out and getting lucky. And I mean, sometimes it might take you five days. Sometimes it might be the first hunt.
crushed him. I mean, we just crushed him. I mean, that is a cool big old nine point. What an awesome morning we're hunting. <laughs> This is really cool. I mean, the Humorax here, Saber Elite too. We've got two barrels here. <laughs> what a cold deer. I gotta get shook and shook up here. I mean, we had, I mean, we right, right early dark, we had this, I mean, cool looking eight point young deer. It's gonna be a stud. He's out here milling around the brush. And then a, a doe come in and, a, and her, I mean, they started chasing and snort wheezing and running around. That's one of the coolest things to see in deer hunting. And then we had another buck come in. He's a six point with no brow thines. And then we had a little spike come in. They all got milling around and they all kind of started looking behind us. And sure enough, here comes a stud. I mean, big old nine point, big body, big white antlers. And he just started moving around out here. He gave me a perfect shot. I had a brush in the way two or three times. So I was trying to be patient. I kind of thought they were going to say, well, once they got there, I said, you good, Jeff? You wasn't getting any more time. Oh. <laughs> well, I mean, that <coughs> smoked him. <laughs> I seen a blood find out of him when you hit him. You smoked him. Oh, that looks good. We're still going to give him some time. I mean, with any arrow, I sure like to give him time. You can see the big fly of dirt here. The arrow right here. And it is plum covered up. Look at that. Right here. Had a baby. Oh, there he is. That's what I'm looking for. Heck yeah. It's funny how they open up like that, right? Look at all that dirt. Yep. Holy cow. Oh, man. Ain't no ground shrinkage on him. Oh, that's where the exit right there. Yeah, so you, I mean, you hit him where we thought. I mean, thought. you yeah. made a perfect shot on him. Yeah. That is so cool. What a great way to hunt with something new. The Umar X, Air Saber X2. We got the hands on a buck that we really wanted to get our hands on. A great, great deer. And uh, we had another story for the books.